When it comes to hunting the West, one of the rarest opportunities and most sought after tag has to be a sheep tag, especially a desert bighorn sheep tag. When one of my buddies drew the tag of a lifetime, me and a bunch of friends joined in on the hunt to try to help him out and make the best of a once in a lifetime opportunity. I hope you guys enjoy this hunt from the vault. I actually saw a ram that on the top of this mountain below us. We had almost two weeks blocked out for the hunt toward the end of the season when most of the other hunters were out of the unit. So it'd give us a chance to look over a lot of rams and hopefully find a ram that Joe thought worthy of putting his tag on. So we're gonna come down, connect to the main road, and then come over these pass roads and probably do like a loop back in here. But there's a guzzler here, another guzzler up here, and there's guzzlers, two guzzlers over here. And the sheep will just kind of bounce around even though they're not using the guzzlers right now. Good. They'll still kind of move in those general areas. Uh, this is a great area. There's big sheep in here. It's just you've got to find them. So we kind of split up. Everybody's kind of gone in a different direction. My buddy Joe, the guy with the tags, hunting one area. Me and my friend Mike are checking out this area. And uh, we're just kind of dividing and conquering. And hopefully someone can turn up a big ram. Climbed up pretty much to the base of these cliffs here, it's pretty high up. And uh, I'm just gonna get on this point and actually glass back down to these mountains toward the valley because that's where I've been seeing most of the rams. No matter what you're hunting, it seems like, you know, maybe 90% of the animals are in about 10% of the country. So we're all just, you know, they're doing like I'm doing, just sitting here in glass and glass and glass and glass and cause sooner or later, we're gonna find the rams we're looking for. He might be right in there, right at that 160. He's heavy. Except if you want a real big one, you gotta pass up lots of ones like that. Get bigger, you know. Pretty good looking sheep. Not at all. He's got that same shape. He's just got that same look to him. I mean, he's boxy, but he's. I think there's a bigger one. We could just crawl over that rock pile right now and just see how far it is, get set up, wait. Since we got other eyes on it, let's mm -hmm. um, let's see if if Josh will glass out in front of us just to make sure that the ram's not right there. All right. Yeah, that's a good idea. It's kind of like makes a little saddle right there. We'll be right in there. I think we'll definitely be in range. Ah, the sheep's gotta be around somewhere. We gotta get stuck. He's Reload. down. No, he's not. There yeah, he's down. You got him. That's a great reel. <laughs> Good job, baby. You're three sheep away from a grand slam now. <laughs> and, and you got the hardest one out of the way. Wow. 
I like these chipped up horns. You got character. The ram is down and we are now heading down the mountain. The sun just dipped behind the hill here and uh, we're making it back to the truck in dark. A lot of help getting him off the mountain. That's the sweet thing about hunting like this with everybody. It's, it's pretty much exciting as much for the guy that shot it as it is for everyone else. This has just been an awesome trip. Only out west this kind of thing happens.